Are you V? Please, step v, in the vehicle. How you doing, honey? Listen, got a golden opportunity for you. Word on the streets that when Waco says golden, it's usually a turd wrapped in crepe paper. It's a sticky situation. Sticky? Please, step in the vehicle. Wow, you're really selling this, Waco. Job like any other. Just the clients will demanding. Clients got every right to be demanding. What makes this one any different? Wants everything to go exactly as planned. Willing Please, to break the, the bank vehicle. for it, too. Job like this needs your magic touch, V. Anyone less experienced it, just fuck it up. Huh. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Now I'm sure it's a turret in crepe paper. So what's the spec? Please, step in the vehicle. Step in the vehicle. So you want me to murder someone? Wait. This isn't the Dalai Lama. Must have gotten the wrong number. You didn't arrive in this pond yesterday, V. You know how Please the fish the gets vehicle. sliced. The perp being proven guilty? Meaning he deserves to die, truly? Do I look like a criminal prosecutor to you? What did he do, exactly? I'm not a beat Please, reporter, neither. Vehicle. You want the job or not? All right, I'm in. Good. Client will be waiting for you by a car at the corner of 6th and Brandon. Huh. In a car? Client wants to tag along. Be there in Please, person when you put a bullet through the guy's eye. Good luck. Hello, V. I'm Jefferson Perales. You've already spoken with Elizabeth, my wife. Perales? <laughs> the one running for mayor of Night City. The one? So the one who is DA until recently, but just vaulted into a seat on the city council. I gather you now understand why discretion is of the utmost importance. Nice to meet you, Mr. Perales. Mrs. Perales. Hmm, right again, Liz. You see, my wife is a great judge of character. Said this would work. Now I see why. So, what do you got for me? Carter, let's go. Elizabeth? Well, as you're probably aware, Mayor Lucius Ryan recently passed. We want to know how, why, Whatever else is pertinent. It's all over the news. Of course it was. Media feasted for weeks. Pieces like that are their lifeblood. Right. Think they missed something? We have reason to believe they did, yes. As far as I remember, Someone tried to zero Ryan a few days before his death. The NCPD sees no link. They're saying it was a random cyber psycho attack. Claim the mayor died of natural causes. Causes unrelated to the attack. It's in the official reports. Ryan died at home due to a cardio implant malfunction. These suspicions of yours wouldn't have anything to do with the upcoming election. Would they? Of course they would. If Lucius Ryan was murdered, we want to know. Need to know. What makes you think the cops got it wrong? Got any evidence? Shortly before Ryan passed, he made cuts in the NCPD budget. Perhaps got on someone's bad side that way. In any case, we have the cyber psycho attack on a BD. Our chief of security scanned it, but didn't find anything out of the ordinary, so to speak. We need a brain dance editor, a real one. It's raw footage. The brain dance. It has to be back where it belongs today, or a lot of people will be in a lot of trouble. If you agree to help, you can see it right now. 
Where'd you get the scroll? Ryan was making a public appearance. BD scrolling standard procedure for events like that. Following the attack, the NCPD impounded the footage as evidence. We had to pull many strings to extract it. All right. See what I can do. Excellent. We'd be happy with any find that would clarify things. Alleviate lingering doubts. Well, what do we got here? Question is, what are you doing here? My brain too, isn't it? And this time, don't go scrolling every ass you see. Eyes on the mayor. Stuff belongs to City Hall. Let's make it PG. Who's the Hulk guy? No idea, those ass clowns are all the same. Second conference in three days. No idea what this blitz is for. That's why I'm mayor and you're not. Now's when we need the visibility. You're spreading yourself too thin. I'll rest tonight. My room at the Red Queen's race is ready. Yes, of course. Good. Now go. Gotta practice. Red Queen's race? Cause any inner synapse zaps? Sure, a bunch of old Brit farts and powdered wigs shouting, Off with their heads! You know, you're allowed to say you don't have a clue. Now go. Got a press. They left literally seconds before the attack. It looks planned. Like it was done on purpose. That or the psycho saw his chance and took it. Don't get paranoid on me. Stop right there! Slow your roll! River Ward, NCPD. Police. Let him in? Let him wait. It's important. Gotta speak to the mayor's chief of security. Cream, do it after the conference. The cop wanted to tell security something. Probably that he was standing by to lick Ryan's butthole.
scream. Do it after the conference. <laughs> Tune. Don't recognize it. Tune. What he's humming. Wouldn't call that a tune. He's really into it. <laughs> Could have chromed half the city with what he was packing. Probably what happened. Body disappeared from the morgue, sight unseen. And then some pig got himself a new set of wheels in an ugly-ass suit. Know that? We're just talking out your ass again. Once you've seen all I've seen, don't need to know things to know them. People are the same everywhere. Okay, it's coming out your ass. <laughs> right as he went through the gate. Yeah, glitch is no accident. Nah, seen stranger coincidences. Like? Like when you bang some chick and then her sister, later, same night. And it turns out they're both sisters of God. That really happened to you? Nah, but it could've. <laughs> well, well, well. <laughs> Fantastic. So, anything? Did you uh, see anything suspicious? Anything at all? Or are we paranoid? All things stinks worse than Coronado Bay in July. Huh. So suspicions confirmed. Any questions at this point? Red Queen's race. What is it? Got me. Never heard of it. Sorry. Who's Holt? Ryan's deputy. And his bulldog, so to speak. Running in Ryan's place now. Conference. Why was it held? For no particular reason. Ryan liked the sound of his voice and seeing himself on TV. That sort of thing. As far as I recall, the drop in Night City's violent crime rate was the excuse for this one. Ryan came out to tout it. <laughs> Sorry, drop. Ryan reclassified Pacifica an independent district. Stats for that part of town stopped counting. <laughs> Clever. Cop who saved Ryan. Know anything about him? Detective River Ward. Good guy. We worked a few cases together. You want to talk to him? I'll put you in touch. Mayor's Hustle, the NCPD? No. All handpicked by Holt. And on a corpse payroll. But there are ex cops among them. Anyone else besides Ryan's detail have access to the terminal? Hmm. NCPD. That's it. Sheesh, what a great timing. Either has crazy good luck or had a source. Got good info. I'm gonna need some of each. Well said. I'm sending you his deeds. If you need anything else, let us know. We'll help.
This is Ward. Who am I talking to? Name's V. Looking into the death of one Lucius Ryan. Wonder why you're not a cop. Jefferson and Elizabeth Perales hired me to do it. Presumptive mayor sniffing around his predecessor's untimely death. Interesting. Done some digging, got more intel. Also interesting. All right. I'm headed to Chubby Buffaloes. Be their stat. Someone start. here to see you, looks like. I will wait where oh, we met before. Wonder why the stalls. Me. Just stay out of trouble, okay? You must be V. My partner, Detective Han. Okay. Thanks for agreeing to meet. You really intend to work with a merc? Don't know what I intend just yet. Now I'm gonna see if I hear anything new about Ryan's death. You back on that? Boss already told you to drop it. You can say it again. You know he hates to say things twice. And if you couldn't give a rat's fat ass about any of that, heed my advice. As your friend, let the case go. You see me do anything? Just sitting here, sipping coffee, listening to gossip. Fine. Do what you want. I'm not about to be partners. Gotta go get my little girl anyway. And you two at least find a quieter corner? Wouldn't want to be over her. Okay. Talk. I see Detective Han's not a fan of edge runners. Don't take it personally. Detective Han's not a fan of anybody. Except his daughter. You wanted to talk? Before the attack, you wanted to talk to Ryan's hustle. Get some info to them. What was it? You know what? Han was right. Acoustics are a little too good in here. Got my car outside. Okay, sure. Some of the boys from the precinct saw Horvath around Arroyo, shooting up dumpsters, hollering how he's got to meet with the mayor. Brought him in. Brought who in? Peter Horvath. Cyberpsycho who would 
contact the mayor later. We took him downtown, but then he got lost before they could get his statement. Managed to quickly stop out that fire. The journalist who broke the story, Franz K. So you saw him as a potential threat, decided to warn the mayor. Just like that. Because he got a good heart. Make it sound like that's something to be ashamed of. Ashamed? Nah. It's not something you see every day. Said he got lost. How's that happen? What's it mean? It means someone didn't want him counting roaches in a cell that day. And before you ask me, no. I got no idea who. My turn. Why is Perales looking at this now? Why does he want it done unofficial on the hush hush? As I see it, Perales is out to smear Holt. So he thinks Holt's involved? No, but even if he's not, the murdered mayor isn't great optics for his deputy. Perales could just be scared. Doesn't want the job of a guy who just got carried out feet first. <laughs> who would? Red Queen's race. Heard anything about it? Know what it is? Maybe I have. Maybe I do. They got anything to do with Ryan? The guy was headed there the day he died. <sighs> Fine. We're gonna see my CI. All I've heard is some fancy ass club. No idea where to even look for it. CI might know. Then we'll go talk to the woman Horvath worked for. Or actually, we could see her first. Up to you. I'm sorry. We? Can't shake this case. Something's up. Just look how quickly it was closed. This way, you can get your job done, while I find evidence that gets my chief to reopen the case. Win-win. So, put you first. Let's go see your informer. The club's a better lead. Fine with me. My guy works here. You go talk to him. I'll wait outside. Tell him Igor says hi. He'll know what it's about. He's your CI. He doesn't know me. Well, uh, last we met, it didn't go so well for him. People he ratted out got wind of it. I think you got a better chance of getting him to talk without me. At least voluntarily. Who is this guy? Proud proprietor. He's got all sorts of clients, and he's nosy as hell. So he knows all about everyone. Plus, he's a coward. Perfect combo. All right, wait here then. You looking for a uh, general inspiration or something specific? Because I can help with both. Looking for a club, Red Queen's Race? If I was you, I'd try somewhere a little more welcoming. Lizzie's over in Kabuki is a good start. Or Cloud's in Japantown. Want an address. Look, club's invitation only, right? You don't know the address, it means you're not welcome. Igor says hi. Fuck, no. Said I was done. I was out. Get the fuck alone.
relax. Just got one question to ask you. Nothing is... See here, sir. Come on, ghost, I said. Leave me alone, got it? Can't make me do a damn thing. Rest assured, nobody will find out you talked to us. And this will truly be the last time Detective Ward will visit you. Isn't that right, Detective? Right. I swear it on the spirits of my ancestors. All we want is the courts for Red Queen's race. All right, but this is the last time, for real. It's outside city limits, near the river, Benita Street area. You been there? Made some deliveries, goods, sometimes peeps. I got no idea why you want to go poking around there. Club's empty. They shut it all down. Shut it down? Before or after Mayor Rhine died? Uh, soon after, I guess. Thanks, Neil. <laughs> My shit luck! Well, well. That's what I call a breakthrough. It seems promising, but I'd still hit that market. Market? Horvath's employer, one I mentioned before. I just wouldn't let that lead drop. Okay. Let's go see this market of yours. We're gonna take my car? Sure. Thanks. V, it's a good thing you answered. I could probably use your help. Probably? Fine. I could really use your help. Can we meet? Deep breaths, Pan Am. Tell me what's going on. Do you remember Saul? The leader of the clan I left? Yeah, yeah. I had a falling out or something. Doesn't matter right now. He... They nabbed him. This is just not suitable for a call, V. Just tell me when and where. You don't know how good it is to hear that. Swing by the Aldecaldos camp. I'll explain it all. The Aldecaldos? Thought you parted ways. Look, it's a long story. Just hurry over. I'm here. Good 90% of any detective's job is talking, but you know that already. Must say, you're kinda a natural. And the other 10%, what's it consist of? Writing reports. So, who are we supposed to talk to? CyberCycle's boss, you said? Christine Markov, 42. File has her as Horvath's sole employer. Sole contact, too, actually. Come on, V. idea who we're looking for. Gonna have to ask around. I'll start from the left and we'll take the right.
What's up? Christine Markov. Well, I thought you're Christine Markov. No, but I know who she is. Stand with the tech over on the other side. Christine Markov, we have some questions. You badges? Looking for data on Pater Horvath. Worked here, apparently. Yeah, he did. Then he stopped working, started making fucking speeches all the time. Behavior actually start. Look, when you're talking about Pedo, weird doesn't mean what it means for everybody else. Horvath never was completely normal. But the post jail Horvath versus the pre jail Horvath? Gonks both, but completely different gonks. Horvath make good scratch here. Could have bought this whole market with the chrome he was packing. Oh, yeah, made scads on scads here. <laughs> Motherfucking millionaire, like we all are. So where'd he get the Eddies? Know anything? Look, if I knew, I wouldn't be here selling scop to tower trash. I'd get myself an AB, fly my fucking slim ass out of here. Pady showed up one day with all that. Extra worked up, too. Whacked enough that I asked him where he got it. He said somebody finally seen what he was worth. And then he launched right into one of his tirades. These, uh, speeches. What did he have to say? Ryan, a corpse got him by the balls and cock, but he still managed to fuck me. His motto. Why'd he have it in for the mayor? Ha! <laughs> Looking for reason in that whack job? Probably thought Ryan was talking to him through the TV, promising all sorts of shit, then ceasing to give a fuck. Look, I told you what I think. In Horvath's world, everybody was out to get him. Lucius Ryan was out to fuck him, then get him. Where were you? Come on. So as Horvat saw it, who else had it in for? Besides Ryan? A uh, Madame President, mostly. Then Arasaka, the Giza, and when he died, it was his son's turn. Would that be all, detectives? You're spooking my clientele. Somebody'd finally seen what he was worth. Horvath had sponsors. We might have guessed as much. Might seem like we didn't get a lot out of that. But sometimes intel makes sense once you've got some context. Say, for instance, somebody says they got a headache. Minor detail. Means nothing, right? Usually, sure. But then the guy Where's walks all this stuff come from? oncoming traffic. Neighbor remembers someone had worked on the air conditioner in the guy's unit. Guy whose head always hurt. Accident? Coincidence? Or maybe air dispersed poison? A deliberate hit. You actually caught a case like that? No. Made it up. Still proves my point. Oh, great. Let me handle this, V. Step aside, Lug. Your boyfriend got sent up for years. Doubt you want the same. Hey, gentlemen, gentlemen, chill. Please. <laughs> Jump, clown. Jump! Let's get this party started! Ha ha ha! God damn it, V. Told you 
might handle it. Where are you going? Walking the streets with you? Downright unsafe. Got a beef with all gangs or just the tigers? I'm a cop. What do you think? Good thing nobody got killed. A little less paperwork. Okay. We're at Queen's Race now. You gonna ride with me? Sure, I'll ride with you. Come on, V. Ah, shit! This is animal turf. I can see that. Lock up any of theirs recently? Not lately, no. But they're not big fans of pigs, either. I can't go in without a warrant. But you... Uh-huh. All right. Be in touch. You find anything, tell me. Thank <laughs> you. 